Ciao a tutti! In this video, Italian Grandma Margarita will show us three ways to prepare lentils, Italian style. Lentils with cotechino sausage is particularly associated with New Year's in Italy. But they are truly an easy and delicious dish to make year-round. She'll show us how to make them vegetarian, with sausage, and with a popular condiment in Italy, cotechino. Let's start with the vegetarian version. Here we are using a small variety of brown lentils, which don't need to be pre-soaked. Grandma says to cover the brown lentils with an inch of water, add a bay leaf, and cook them on medium heat until tender, 15 to 25 minutes. Check for doneness and remove them from the heat as soon as they are tender. Now she's preparing the flavoring, onion, carrot, and celery. Grandma says that the key to her super tasty lentils is to mince these ingredients together. You can use a food processor if you'd like. The veggies should be so small that they practically melt as they are cooking. She adds a few tablespoons of olive oil to a saucepan, the minced vegetables, and a bit of water. Questo si stuferà e si scioglierà e quando mangerete le lenticchie non sentirete i pezzetti. Adesso andiamo a mettere And simmers them on medium heat for 5 to 10 minutes until the veggies are tender. Ecco qua il soffritto è pronto. Adesso prendiamo le lenticchie e le mettiamo dentro. Time to add the lentils that we've already cooked with a little bit of their cooking water. And cook on low heat with the vegetables for about 5 minutes. Grandma says if we serve these lentils without adding meat, we can add a bit more water and a potato, and we have a delicious minestra. Another classic Italian dish you can make with these lentils? Pasta and lentils. Grandma says to look for tiny pasta shells, which are particularly delicious with lentils, since the lentils tend to nestle into the shells. Il pomodoro. Stir it often, Grandma says, to avoid the lentils sticking to the pan. Time for the non tomatoes. Just a bit. And a bit of chili pepper and salt to taste as well. Ma potete metterlo al gusto vostro e come, come volete. Questo è molto piccante, eh? Quindi io vado piano piano. Aggiungo un pochino di sale. Il tanto che è per il pomodoro, perché la lenticchia già era salata. I bravi cuochi assaggiano sempre, non date retta. Io sono brava. Cover again and simmer for 10 minutes longer. Ecco, 5, massimo 10. A 5 minuti l'apriamo. While we are waiting for the lentils to finish, Grandma says to remember to subscribe to the Piatto Recipes cooking channel. And if you like her video, give her a thumbs up. Il piatto è finito. E quindi questo può essere mangiato così. The dish is finished and you can eat it just like this, serving it with a few slices of bruschetta and some fresh extra virgin olive oil. This olive oil was just pressed fresh from olives picked on Grandma's land. E buon appetito! Or add some sausage and make another traditional Italian variation. And by the way, the so-called Italian sausage sold abroad with red pepper and fennel isn't that common in Italy. Most Italians in Italy think fennel seeds kill the taste of the sausage. In fact, there's an expression in Italian, infinocchiare, which references fennel, and is used to say that someone has been duped, because in the past, fennel seeds were often added to mask spoiled meat or wine. Of course, you can find fennel on occasion in sausage, but it is not associated with the iconic sausage of Italy. Here we are using a sausage flavored with salt, pepper, garlic, and wine.
To add extra flavor and to glaze the pan, she's adding a splash of white wine when the sausages are almost cooked. She cuts the sausage into bite-sized pieces and adds some lentils to the flavorful sausage drippings that we've removed from the bottom of the pan. The drippings definitely add a richer flavor for those who don't mind a little extra saturated fat. And finally, an Italian classic not well known abroad, lentils with cotechino. This dish is traditional at New Year's in Italy. Lentils are thought to bring good financial luck. And cotechino is a type of sausage made from pork rind, pork meat, chopped cartilage, and pancetta. It's seasoned with salt and sometimes spices like rosemary. Since cotechino includes pork rind, it needs to be cooked for a long time. If you have fresh cotechino, you'll need to boil it for four to five hours. If using a pre-cooked product, just follow the package instructions. So there you have it, so many delicious ways to enjoy and cook lentils like an Italian. E con questo piatto vi saluto. E se state guardando questo video durante le feste, buone feste! And don't forget to subscribe for free to our channel for more recipes like this from Italy and beyond. E buon appetito!